Canada, America's oldest, yet now annoyed, ally. Canada has done nothing recently to change the peaceful and mutually beneficial trade pattern that we've had with Canada for a very long time. So why then did President Trump all of a sudden slap steel and aluminum tariffs on Canada, causing Canadian Prime Minister Justin Trudeau to hit back with trade taxes on billions of U.S. goods starting July 1st? Dr. Robert Cooterly is a professor of international trade at the U.S. Humphrey School. He's obsessed by the idea that we're running a trade imbalance with the rest of the world. He doesn't seem very fussy about the situations that underlie that trade imbalance. That situation would hit Minnesota companies hard. Business Insider estimating nearly 200 million worth from Minnesota to Canada could now be taxed. Steel, aluminum, food processing, and agriculture. I hope that he figures out a face-saving way of abandoning this idea. Right now, Canada says it won't back down unless the U.S. does. President Trump, though, has said he needs to protect our national security because increased imports have led to the closing of U.S. steel and aluminum plants. Dr. Kudderly doesn't buy that. I think nobody takes seriously the idea that material coming from Canada represents any kind of security threat to the United States. Our trading relationship with Canada is just fine. It could be better. A friendly relationship that's now turned tense. Corey Eppola, CARE 11 News.